Hi, welcome back. In this video, we're going to discuss customizing the home screen. The home screen consists of the menu bar, which includes all of the features in your QuickBooks, the icon bar, which we can learn how to move, customize, and hide, and the home screen, which is customized by setting your preferences. Let's look at your home screen in QuickBooks. So your home screen probably looks something like this. You'll see the menu bar at the top that contains all of the features in QuickBooks. This cannot be edited, but it is my preferred way to work in QuickBooks because all of the features you need to find are available in the menu bar. You also have an icon bar that is either on the left hand side of your screen or if I click on view I can move the icon bar to the top portion of my screen. So depending on how you prefer to work or how much screen you want the icon bar to take up, you can move that from left to the top. You could also hide that bar completely. You have the menu bar that you can find all of the features you need to use in QuickBooks. Now, the icons on your home screen down here these are edited or changed based on whether or not you turn preferences on or off in QuickBooks. So if I, for example, would want to turn off estimates, you can see it down here in the screen. If I were to go to my edit preferences, select my desktop view, I could turn estimates off. Then when I come back to my home screen, you'll see that the feature for the estimates is no longer listed here. So that would be how you would customize your home screen. Now, if, I'm gonna turn my left icon bar back on. If you prefer to have the icon bar, this icon bar can be customized to include only the features that you use most often. So to do that, we will go up to View, Customize Icon Bar, and from here, these are all the features that are on our icon bar. We could click to add or remove any features that we want to see or don't want to see. So if I wanted to take the My Company off, I could highlight it and click on Delete, Income Tracker, and you can see over here that those are changing as I take them off. Bill Tracker, Calendar, Okay, so I've taken most of the icons off. Now I only have an icon for my home screen, my customer, and my vendors. Now even if I were to move, I'll go up and change that to the top icon bar. Now you can see we only have four icons here, where before the whole icon bar was filled up. But you can add or remove as much as you want from the icon bar. It's just kind of a shortcut for the things that you do most often. Go up to view and hiding it gives you a little bit more workspace on your desktop. That's particularly helpful if you're filling in forms. The form space is a little bit bigger so you have a little bit more room to see more details. Okay, so that's your menu bar. That's my preferred way to work in QuickBooks. Everybody has their own way. You have your icon bar, which can be either on the top or the left or hidden completely. You can also customize that icon bar by going to view, customize icon bar. And you can add and remove features from your home screen by setting your preferences to turn those features on or off.